So let's uh, Sean, seeing as how um, we've deemed you the unofficial ringleader, um, why don't you tell everybody what we're doing here? Yeah, well, I don't have that outline, so uh, you don't need an outline. <laughs> Just tell them what we're doing. Yeah. All right, I'll no, tell them what they're right, doing. Yeah. Then. <clears throat> yeah. So if you want to, uh, go ahead. Go no, ahead. All right. Throw so it. I'm Sean Brereton, and uh, we are here with the first Rodders podcast. Um, we may we decide with to that change name that name officially. I don't know. We may decide to change that name, so we may be asking folks uh, exactly what they think this should be called. But uh, we have Mike Abbott, Hi. Sean Young, and Javier Augustine. Ooh, hey, oh, Javi. Well, so, um, yeah. So we just thought uh, we've always been talking about doing a podcast for a long time, and uh, just uh, some of the stupid stuff that we do and think of and talk and easy. And all that. It's uh, not that stupid. Come on. We're pretty stupid. Too. It's, no, it's, it's really stupid. No, I get out of here. Come <laughs> it's, on. it's stupid. We do awesome so, stuff. Yeah. So sometimes it's about awesome stuff. Sometimes it's about stupid stuff. And uh, so, yeah. So this is the first podcast. And um, I don't know where we start other than I guess we can kind of talk about who we are first uh, for people who don't know who we are. And um, I think all eight of the people watching us right? know who <laughs> yeah. we are. Hey, I've got 11. So, you got 11? Yeah. I only 11. have eight. <laughs> I'm not as popular. As you. How are you and I sharing the same eight? Yeah. So you, you have eight? I have eight. I because think your friends are my friends. You know, he's got a whole nother group of like fraternity guys that he hangs yeah. out with. <laughs> <laughs> there's, another three, there's another three people that he knows that we don't know. Right, right. He's sure. got a whole nother group. Of All right. So everybody's still people. saying that we're really echoing. So I don't know if check your, check your volume. It'll only let your volume go down. Yeah. Just so, so much. much. Okay. So. I don't know how to change that. But what do you guys think? Yeah, I don't know. I, can't, I don't know. I can't, I can't fix it either. Yeah. Does anybody know how to change that? Nope. We just got to deal with it. No. No. Yeah, we, we probably should figure that out. Yeah. It's, yeah. Well, well that's can, probably. If all eight good. of my viewers are annoyed, then I'm annoyed. Right. Right. <laughs> Maybe, maybe if, uh, well, I mean, they got to hear Hold on, so. Mom. I'm working on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Javier has eight listeners on our first one. That's yeah. awesome, oh, man. Yeah, that's right. and all eight it's of them a, are my mom. She yeah. borrowed all of my <laughs> <laughs> It's like his mom, his aunt, my mom, his sister. My sister's phone. <laughs> yeah. There'll probably be a lot of my, mom jokes on this thing. Both no, of, uh, we we we, we no. did a pact. We're not going to no, do that. No mom jokes. Not, not this episode. Not this Hold episode. On. We did a pact about no, we, no mom jokes. We, not we the, did I not. was not involved in that conversation. You no, know, it was a no Sean's mom's jokes. I mean, uh, like, yeah, everyone uh, else's mom's on the table. <laughs> That's okay. Funny. All right. Uh, maybe you can cover your microphone with your hand. I'm well, if you cover your microphone, they're not going to be able to hear you. So that's not going to work. Uh, yeah. See, because these microphones that we're talking on aren't aren't chimed into our phones. That's yeah, this true. is definitely not going to work that way. A a rough idea. Yeah, um, it's that definitely we a no rough start. Doing. Yeah, very we, rough start. Like, this has nothing to do with what we came here to do. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. So let's so let's just get rolling, yeah, Mr. We'll Zuckerberg. Just, if you're listening, yeah. please <laughs> fix the join as a group. Your Zoom call yeah. situation needs some attention. So. Right, right, right. Um, I, I don't know how to fix that. I think we should probably yeah, just, Sean Williams. Yeah, let's just go. Yep. Let's yeah, just we're just go. gonna go with we're the podcast it, and deal Sorry. with it on Facebook. We'll yeah. just still we'll leave it on Facebook, and I, if people like it. They, I, I they would, can, well, let's uh, let's just go with Brandon as the primary, and they can listen through you because they can hear us talking. I guess I don't know that they can hear us talking across the room. Mm, yeah, because once you yeah. once you go off there, you're probably well, yeah. Okay, yeah. I haven't lost eight people yet. So oh, there we go. Yeah. I'm um, still on. 11. How, you're an eleven. I'm ask, still on 11. ask your eleven if uh, my eight. <laughs> I'm still on eight. If, Hold if on. Seven out of my eight are my people. Mom? I don't know how to do know. this. I don't know. I'm all right. Anyway, anybody. I don't all think right. Let's, all right. Let's just go. Yeah, we're just gonna. Let's just go. All right. So let's do it. Let's go ahead, Mike. Abbott, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself and say what you what you do for a living and uh, why you're here? Yeah, uh, Mike Abbott, um, Steel Rose Metal Co. Uh, yeah, that's a uh, that's my thing uh, is to do custom sheet metal, um, anything custom. Uh, I prefer hot rods. Um, I prefer at least pre 1972. Um, but to be honest, I struggle uh, with muscle cars. I'm not a big muscle car guys. As these guys are. But you have a 69 Camaro in your... Shh. Oh, oops. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> here he goes. Here he goes. Yeah. And, and occasionally, Sean Brarrington does weddings. 
Um, <laughs> <laughs> and the occasional calendar. Right. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, we we have been kicking this idea around for for uh, for a little while now. I don't know, probably a year. What do you say, Javier? A year? Yeah, I think maybe it started a year. A year. Yeah, maybe, yeah, we, maybe we a year yeah. ago. And we're actually going to try and do this thing for real instead of just talking about it. Yeah. Um, even though it seems like we do a lot of stuff, uh, we talk about a lot more than we actually do, if the, if anybody can wrap their mind around that. So, yeah, but yeah. it sounds like a statement for your therapist. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's exactly it. I, I don't go to therapy. I make black. Uh, that, okay, uh, yeah. we'll put uh, a pin in that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's, for, that's for late. I don't believe in that. All right, so, All right yeah. so, then so, let's, yeah, so let's go on to Javier, seeing as how he has something well, to say about everything. I'm, what do you do and who are you? Well, so I'm a not certified therapist. You know? <laughs> I know. That's what this is. <laughs> this is an intervention. <laughs> uh, Javier Agustin on Facebook and Instagram, I guess. We got, my actual name is Carrasco. You know, we, we talked about rolling the R's. I don't, I don't know. I don't feel comfortable. Yeah, throw it. Throw it. Roll the R's. That's right. Embrace your hair, too. That's right. Embrace your hair. I feel extra tan when I roll the R's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's wintertime. I'm going to let the, uh, the white coat come out. So. Okay. Right. <laughs> the, um, Bomber Steel Customs, um, just getting into that. The um, There's going to be a ca big car thing into that, and that's how uh, Mike and I kind of got acquainted. But I'm just in, the, in, just in the first development phase of an actual business, which is uh, custom airstreams and restoration, vintage things. But uh, I came upon the group, and the group actually has been developing over the last uh, – couple years yeah it's been in more than a couple time probably. flies though it's yeah. been like three yeah. years like i think about been in like, my new building almost three years that's insane because it feels like yeah. the first time i met you was like i guess three and a half years now because i met it you. it was longer than that it was longer We're than four that. years yeah that's, yeah oof. okay <laughs> yeah so my other uh, one of my 12 other unfinished projects that we started together on yeah. those four years <laughs> yeah 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 it's been that long. i should probably get on that yeah yeah right it's been that anyway long. that's about that's about it and uh what do you do for a living 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 uh, living uh you what, know, no, we're, i'm we're, actually we're, we're gonna, gonna leave that alone we're gonna leave that, we're gonna leave that alone yeah. for now <laughs> Uh, All right, we'll if, go on. If the they next only guy. knew, yeah, so I, yeah. I'll kick it over to the other guy, who's right, actually so, a, a, a buddy of mine, Sean Young. Yes, Sean Young. Uh, I am the, I guess, co-owner with my wife of Kingfish Metalworks. We do, uh, you know, a lot of custom commercial signs as well as uh, you know original metal art and uh, a lot of replicas, uh, Petroliana. You know, a lot of hot rod based, you know, art. Uh, that that's primarily our, our our main focus that's the part of it that i really enjoy so and uh javier and i are actually partners in a building business in a business sense uh, yeah in, in a business sense so <laughs> yeah. in, it, you know historically Biblically. speaking you guys will kind of dig this javier and i own a building that was part of a company called plastic products back in the 50s that was the original record pressing factory for stacks Sun and uh, there were several other local record companies, but yeah, we own the building that all of that uh, used to happen in, and that is uh, actually our world world headquarters. World headquarters. World I appreciate you throwing me under the bus. The today. You don't know that you did that, but you know <clears throat> I did. he broke out. You know, Sean broke out the whole. I'm I'm, I'm co-owners of my business with my wife. Yeah. Uh, yeah oh I appreciate no! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just throw me right under. <clears throat> I, yeah. Me too. Hold on, I'm getting, yeah. a I'm, I'm getting a text from Ray right now. Right. What did he just Me say? Too. Right, too. right. Too. But, yeah. uh, but, it, yeah. it, but to that, you know, not to get away from what we do, but I, I think what brings us all together is we're all, you know, just into this car thing. And that that's where we all find common ground. We're all kind of from different, different walks of life and, you know, different upbringings. And uh, when it comes to hot rods and that kind of thing, man, I think we're, we're all the same. We all bleed the same color. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's st it's still, still red. Yeah, it's red. Yeah. <laughs> is it? It's, red. it's, well, hey, it's more, like oil. You know, more I, more to the point of him though. Like I, I found a lot of therapy since we're getting back on therapy on, on getting back to that. You know, yeah, I, I did a lot of it when I was younger. And then family things happen, your career happens, um, and then you find yourself in a place where you're like, there's like something missing. I I've done a lot of fun things. I've been a lot of cool places, and. Uh, for me and uh, I had a buddy Trey and uh, there was just a lot of like frustration, just like, just, I guess maybe coming of age kind of thing, just being responsible. And you've always kind of really been into yeah. it, never really left it. It did become your bread and butter for a while. So that kind of changes it. But then you find joy back in doing it. Right. I'm, I'm not speaking for you, but yeah. on my no, end, that's true. It, there was a project here or there, but it was like, no, uh, my son's older now. I, I have the funds to allocate for that. Sure. But 
I was literally opening up a pressure relief valve, getting right. back into it. It was like yeah. I didn't realize that that was a missing part of me until right. I got back into it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Well, and I, I don't think it's just the cars. Um, you know, I mean, cars are cool, uh, but it dawned on me, I don't know, maybe a month ago or something like that, I was I was talking with somebody, you know, and, and they had this great story. And, of course, it was about cars. Um, but I, But I think that's, like, the coolest part to me is the cars are awesome and we get to drive cool stuff and go do awesome things with our friends and hang out and, you know, tear up the streets. But, like, the stories that come along with it, for me, is a big deal to me. Like, I love hearing, you know, when you're talking to a 70-year-old dude and he's, like, telling you this story about, you know, man, I had this car at this point in time and this is what life looked like and it's almost like a time machine yeah, for that person. Yeah, there's it's a like connection trigger, there. Yeah. You yeah. Know? Um, I love the stories that are involved with it. Like, the stories are, are what gives it validity, yeah, um, at least in my mind. Yeah, you know? absolutely. I mean, <clears throat> well, I didn't say what I do, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, yeah, what, yeah. Do do, yeah. what do you do, Sean? Yeah. What do you do? I mean, other than sleep till me. Yeah, be a terrible <laughs> IT guy. I do that sometimes. <laughs> yeah, IT guy. I don't know how I got that job. But, uh, yeah, no, I'm, you know, freelance photographer and editor and... Um, mostly nudes, writer, all that stuff. Yeah, mostly nudes. Mostly yeah. selfies. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> all that. I'm an Instagram. He model. sends a lot of inappropriate texts. To I don't like you people anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it is so why did I, why did I volunteer for this? <laughs> he's always with the favorable angle. You know, he's if anybody was to take that picture, it's going to be him. Yeah, like for sure. you could probably make a selfie cell phone picture look really good. Yeah, right. In photos. Yeah, no. I, <laughs> I always, I always no, get that job that. no matter what, but yeah. yeah, but no, I mean, um, that's, that's one of the things that attracted me to do, to go freelance and do, um, to do what I'm doing, uh, is, is the stories, you know, yeah. like being able to talk to somebody and see what their connection is with that car. Right. That's, that's the cool part to me is like being able to talk about, uh, you know, to take somebody's car that they love and have had forever or you know it was their mother's or their grandfather right. or something like that to be able to, to to tell that story to people um that's one of the things i really enjoy the most right about doing you know yeah. about about the car scene yeah for really, sure you know for yeah. sure yeah yeah even though people you know they have a tendency to to look at a car as just like a, a piece of property, you know, people yeah. that aren't or just in the car means world. of conveyance. Right. Like, it just yeah. gets me from here. To there. Yeah. Or like right. a status symbol or whatever, you know, like, Oh, I got this, you know, this car and I'm somebody now or whatever. Yeah. But, um, one of the things that's always blown me away about cars is, is it becomes so much more than just a thing, you know? Yeah. Um, it, you know, and people that aren't in car world, I guess they don't really understand that. Yeah. Like they, yeah. they look at it like a tennis shoe or something like that. And like, when you get done with it, you just, you get another one and you throw it away and it's just, you know, it gets me there. Um, yeah. but cars have a soul. Um, well, yeah, no, hundred yeah, percent, you know, more I, than just a thing. And I'll talk about our buddy Gene just for a second. He yeah. spent a lot of time and you were talking about What's up, Gene? Seven, How you doing? Gene yeah. McCoy, if you're listening. Hey, that's right. Right. I, mean, I see um, some thumbs up there for me. Yeah. This is, uh, directly to the point with i've been spending a lot of time with him and we talked about this you know we talk about all his cars and if you if you, we've all been out to his house if, yeah. if you ever get the opportunity to be invited please don't show up at his house that's a bad do that. idea um if you ever do get the opportunity you see his collection they're all they're all beautiful cars and uh he and i've worked on the coupe we had a coupe deal and he and i became bigger bigger friends over that and we talked about what What's your favorite car, Gene? And they're all his babies. Right. Just right. like they'd all be your yeah, babies. For sure. He's, but he always tells me the sedan. And right. I say, well, and I'm not, I, I hope I'm not speaking, oh, if he's listening, I hope he's not upset what I'm saying. But he said to me one day, he said, the sedan. And I said, why? He said, that car has. That's a 31, 31 sedan. It's a 31 yeah. sedan. I, and uh, not putting anything out there, but you did the picture spread on that yeah that, yeah hopefully yeah. that yeah yeah that's yeah. i don't want to bleak anything out but if it yeah. happens it happens but the uh, he said that's the one and i said why and he said i there's me i'm built into that car there's right. a there, my soul i left a For piece sure. of my soul in that car yeah, absolutely yeah. and that's the 31 sedan yeah um with the y block yeah. drive power and there's some more stuff i'll talk yeah. about that later just how th how generations bleed off into next generation absolutely and that's what i love about the friendship he and i have started yeah and, yeah uh, and i it, think that's with any craftsman 
yeah, you know, yeah. um, but, but you, what a, you leave a piece of yourself in that. But what does that say about me, man? All of my cars are just garbage. What does that say about <laughs> your my cars soul, aren't garbage? <laughs> no, your, your cars aren't garbage at all. I, I'll tell you, um, what I like about your cars is, is. Oh, we're doing you, this. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Do me next. 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 Yeah, right. Because I really do, do, do. I really do like your cars, even though, you know, but I we mean, need Brington, to say what, what Brington Sean will straight, yeah. straight up be like, well, you know, Mike likes those garbage, you know, rat rocks or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and, and that's all fine. He can hate on me all he wants. Well, Sean likes uh, the pain. I mean, and, whatever. And, and I guess me and you have very similar taste in cars. Yeah, probably um, so, yeah. Yeah. Um, you know that's part of our connection or whatever but what i like about your cars is is you go at your cars more as a piece of art than you do just transportation right sure. you're not trying to impress anybody you're trying to actually um, um express who express you are, who through, you are yeah, you sure. know, as, that, as a piece of art um, that's, that's, with a motor in it that's very and fair. i think that's awesome well, thank and, i think that's super and keep cool. it between the lines and not kill anybody else in the I process which is how i live my life kill right. Right. not just right. in a car yeah for sure yeah absolutely yeah, yeah, that's and I mean, and on the on the flip of that, you have Brarrington, right? That's just like over the top, trying way too hard. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> try five, right, try right. anything that works, really. Right. Oh, fuel <laughs> injection. Yeah. Brarrington, if you're listening, Brarrington out of the four of us, he has the nicer, the nicest the cars. cars, the yeah. shiniest yeah. cars. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, the this is, they the just nicest. have paint on them. I'm just yeah. going to say. Oh yeah. So you're telling oh, yeah. me if we took the paint off your cars, they would be in league with our cars? No. Yeah. No. no. Yeah. Because no. Because mine run. Right. That's that's so, that yeah. I'm a little oh. jealous. I'm not oh. going to say that's a cheap shot. You're going to pay for that. Later. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right. I'm going to have but four flats. Well, well, right. yeah. Show of yeah. hands. Yeah. Not. I mean, you. I, show of hands or count of fingers. Have you want to do? How many unfinished or broke down projects do you have? I've got three going right now okay. that are just in several in different. You're stages. not going to ask me that I'm question. Gonna, like, no, I'm going to ask you. I'm going to put you? a qualifier on it because I've seen your yard. I'm a part of your problem. <laughs> 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 how, how many are you personally invested in making a roll uh, rolling down the road, keep mm. it between the lines piece of? Uh, I mean, wow. Two. Okay. He took I mean, his shoes off. That's not good. I mean, I guarantee, <laughs> I mean, how many I have or how many that I'm actually currently working on to make? Uh, probably four, maybe five. Yeah, including the one hanging from your ceiling. Oh, oh yeah, well, see, no. We're, see, we're now we're talking everything? about, we're, no, oh, no. Well, we're, no. That's, yeah, that's, you can't count all those, then there'd be 30. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. Like, this is why I had to put a qualifier. <laughs> I mean, like, maybe yeah. this is an maybe intervention. Or yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is <a> <laughs> Oh, I, let's, oh, qualifier. You're welcome, How, Ray. Yeah. <laughs> look, look. Uh, I, one, I hope my wife doesn't see this. Um, two, we're um, uh, we're all really concerned, and you're in a safe place. <laughs> <laughs> it is an intervention. We actually right? sold yeah. all of our cars, and we're hoping that you're yeah. going to join us. <laughs> right. Come, right. Pl come play with right. us. Drink the Kool Aid. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm going to get a um, Miata. <laughs> We're not going there. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there, we're going to Miata. <laughs> yes. I tell you, I feel bad for young kids, that, you know, say, hey, look, I'm thinking about buying this old car, and I'm thinking, oh, man, it's going to be the highest of the highest and the lowest of the lows. Right, man. right. You're not ready. <laughs> I want you to buy it because I want you to experience my oh. suffering, but I want you to buy it. Right, right. <laughs> hey, I, you know, maybe change the subject, maybe not. You know, for me, that that was a big thing. Like I always wanted a, a car, you know, and yeah. I started out with a 55, 1500 bucks with right. three on the tree, yeah, you know, and, uh, you know, six cylinder in it and all that stuff. And it had, you know, I drove it to school with a huge, uh, four, you know, a hole in the floorboard and all that kind of stuff. So, right. you know, I, I think it's something that, that kids lack today. Yeah. You know, sure. everybody's worried about, uh, their kid having a, a car with airbags and right. all that business in it and all that. But it's, um, you know, I, I think there's something to it to be able to build and try to do things and turn a wrench that you've never turned before, right. you know? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So, absolutely. Well, yeah. and that and just the uh, the knowing of, of you've accomplished something, you yeah. know. Yeah. Um, I'm not even going to start talking about, safety because it's just not something that i i, I just do yeah. not care about it yeah. like i really don't i think it's a i think it's a falsified sense of security you yeah. know um how are there so many people alive today that are above the age of of 30 yeah. if 
if that stuff was such a big deal. Like, I never rode in a car seat. Did you guys ever ride in a car seat your whole life? I, I don't think that that I was think a I think I held the car seat for my sister. No, I stood <laughs> I stood up on the hump in the back <laughs> right, seat. Right. Yeah. Like, uh, like, I just the package don't... tray? No, yeah, I remember right. sunbathing like a window? cat in the yeah. package <laughs> tray. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, you know, I used like, to I sit on the armrest in the front. I used to sit on the armrest in the front seat. I remember my grandmother hitting a car. Like, head on, you know, like, and it was just a little fender bender. I want to say it was like in a bank line or something like that. And I was laying in the back window, and of course, it just threw me out of the back window. <laughs> the front window, bench seat, and like, <laughs> fell on the floorboard and got up and thought it was hilarious, you know? I mean, I don't know. I just, I'm just not sold on that whole thing. Like, I don't know. I, well, I, remember, I, think, I think they started doing that stuff because they started making cars worse. Like, that's my personal opinion. Uh, they had to put that crap in there because they were making it out of plastic well, garbage. I, well, I think know? the other thing is, is that people aren't taught how to drive anymore. Well, it's probably. I mean, they, a lot they've taken out, that. they've taken out driver's ed and right. and all that stuff, and like you know, people just they have to they have to pass a test, like a written test now to and you to gotta be wait, able to drive. You got to wait six horrible. months with a learner's permit. Yeah, it's crazy. I now. was eight years old when I got behind the wheel of my uncle's truck right yeah yeah i was young too yeah. i mean yeah. mine was most of the time because you know my father wasn't he's there. gone now but i'll tell you it was a uh, it was a company uh, vehicle so the uh, <laughs> texas gas company finds yeah. out about that one. yeah <laughs> my Sorry. most of the time was was an, an, an inebriated father you know and, hey, <laughs> you, were the, you were the dd <laughs> you're the designated driver like i can't i have to stand up to drive yeah. this thing All you right, look like short cool. round you right. tape little boxes to your feet yeah yeah it's, <laughs> <laughs> Indiana Jones. You better hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Dad woke up in the driveway. Right. Yeah. Sorry, Perry. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was totally cool until you apologized. Oh, so the apology <laughs> made it offensive. Yes, Is that what yes, it was? Yes, yes, um, Sean? Yeah. What's, what's your um, experience of, my, okay. on apologies making so, it worse? So my, I, grew up around, I grew up around cowboys. My dad okay. was a cowboy. Yeah. And my earliest remember, remembrance of, of actually thinking I was going to have to drive is when we would go to these rodeos and dad would get hurt and freakishly injured. I mean, right. he'd break an arm or something. And I'm like 10 years old wondering how in the hell are we going to make it home? Because he drove here. Right. You know, and now he's on pain medication and his arm is in a sling. And, right. Uh, it never happened. You know, somehow we, we made it home. But I just knew one day. I'm gonna have to figure this out on the fly, right? You know, and yeah. stick, stick shift. Uh, yeah. Well, no. Back then, my okay. Let's get this on the table. My dad never had cool cars. You know, I, I hear stories from car guys all the time. Oh yeah, my dad had this. You know, no. You don't my, sound bitter at all. My man. dad had garbage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, like conversion vans and, and trucks. Man, there's and, nothing wrong with a conversion van. Econo van, van well, bro? Okay. Conversion van. Well, no. It's well, it like wheels a 1993 well, conversion I guess it's van? A, now we can break into cultural things. You push the wheels out a little bit, drop it about two inches. Right. Yeah, so, so the 78. Drop the dingle balls. <laughs> the lumber the machine. It's the lumber machine, man. Well, the 78 Thunderbird that he had was just not a cool car. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You know, That's so, not a cool car. Well, definitely but, past 70 for you, so you're out. Yeah. Despite the yeah. fact it was hideous. Yeah, to look yeah, at. yeah, yeah, yeah. Still Ford in the Ford family, though. Yeah, but yeah. God, 78. That was like that weird uncle that you didn't want coming yeah, to Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, so, Sean, if, if, if your dad didn't have... Uh, <laughs> Back to therapy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If your dad didn't have cool cars, how'd you get involved? I, I Okay, so my, my parents were children of the 50s, and when American Graffiti came out in the 70s, of course, we were there. And when I saw that, man, and I saw that, that yellow 32, I was in. I was hooked. Yeah. Um, and, and I remember we would go to rodeos, oddly enough, and Dad would point out cars that he knew from his childhood. <clears throat> and I saw a Henry J. Gasser in, uh, I think it was in, in Martin, Tennessee, at a rodeo wow. there. And I was in. I mean, I was absolutely in. And, you know, growing up in a small town in Mississippi, those that style of hot rod didn't exist right you know the, the era that i grew up with i mean it was nothing for a charger to be in the parking lot but right. traditional hot rods just didn't happen and then you know probably i don't know 10 15 years ago you know i i started pursuing it i'd always had an interest in it and i started going down that path yeah uh, but yeah, I'd always wanted to. Some of that stuff that I saw, you know, like like I said, American Graffiti, man. The right. yellow thirty two is just yeah. 
Yeah. So you're telling me that Harrison Ford had nothing to do with your obsession I, I was, with Harrison I don't know, Ford? Man. It, it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, I, yeah, that's oddly. That's the year you got into Star Wars. It, it was. It was a springboard for me. The right. Harrison Ford. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. How'd you get into cars, Javier? I mean, um, it's a family thing, and it's I'm part of the culture, it. man. It's, well, it's right. I know what I talk about it. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's true, though. It that's, comes from a true. long line of lowriders. <laughs> yeah. And. Yeah. Uh, interesting things like this now i had a um i was very fortunate unfortunately i was attending a funeral last week and uh for my uncle hector and uh in his eulogy and talking about him i got to talking about the entire family and we had lost my uh other uncle jesse back in the early 2000s and he was one of the main proprietors of that like, as a young kid i don't remember my father being into cars or anything and he and my mom split early so I, I'm raised by uncles. I say I have like two dads, right? You know, like, um, yeah, as a lot of kids do in that situation. Um, and I got the car stuff from my uncle Jesse, and he right. was always turning wrenches. And both my uncles did. My other uncle Hector was more into building, right? Um, he's raised Eagle Scouts, right? Camping. I, I got all of that stuff from him, right? And the and my cousin jesus jr jesse's son uh we were way into low riders like yeah, I, right. like we were so into low riders this is gonna go off down the mexi lane let's, <laughs> let's go man let's we were so it. into low riders Break out we the did, sombreros. I, yeah no it's no the, the pachuco hat bro yeah, like this right. with yeah, the little right. mustache yeah, um right. i uh i was either gonna be a tattoo artist <laughs> no problem with that i didn't want to judge that um it seemed very permanent at the time <laughs> I was either going to be, I, I drew, and I, I, I had a little stripe of the artist. I get that from my mom, I think, but um, I would be drawing low riders all the time. And my uh, cousin, uh, uh, Jesse Chewy, he would, uh, he, we would get these low rider magazines, low rider art. Low, right. You probably remember low rider yeah, art. Oh, like, yeah. I was way into that. Yeah. So I would, I would just draw and draw, and then we got old enough to, like, hey, we don't, can't afford cars, and we're, like, 12 or 13 but there's these low rider bikes we can do. Right, and, right, yeah. <laughs> I was yeah. Like, yeah. Absolutely. Well, that's, like kind of cool let's do yeah. that how how do we do that and uh uncle jesse and his uncle cruz and that family had a paint and body shop and we started building these little rider bikes and here we go 15 16 years old he gets a 1963 impala ss yeah, for as his first car yeah and my jaw dropped like, yeah. i didn't even nobody even told me i was living uh in i just moved here uh, a few years before nobody told me that he'd got that car and i went right. i used to go there on the summers and I show up, and he's got a Dino. You have to name your cars. Yeah, 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 D for sure. Dino was the name of this car. And uh, it was a, a factory color maroon with a white top uh, SS column numbers match right, and everything. Right. And, and he and his father had put that thing together, and it was our job to keep it going. And it went through two or three motors in the right. time. But I was just so enamored with that car that eventually... Eventually, being a year late, I flipped burgers for two years, and I got a 1964 Impala. Now, it was a four-door, right. but it had some factory options that were kind of rare. So it was a no-post car, right. 327, had the finger hut special, which was a plastic. Right. Yeah, it's a hard yeah. top, yeah. yeah. Had the, uh, everybody was after that car because of the parts that it came with. It, right. I have the original build sheet. If anybody's listening and has that car, I had an opportunity to buy it and didn't have the cash a few years ago. Yeah, yeah. I will do that now. I have, right. I have yeah. ways to get money. <laughs> it's not how you negotiate a deal. I know. <laughs> I'll pay anything. I couldn't negotiate. Car. The problem is, he knew that going right, in the right, thing. Right. I, it was the weirdest thing. My mom came to visit, and I know I got a lot of mic time right now, but yeah. my mom came to visit uh, randomly. I'm driving down Highway 51. I'm headed to Millington to go see some other relatives, and I say, That's my car. And she right. goes, Shut up. That's not your car. And I, right. I'm pulling into the wrecker place where it's at. And I said, No, that's my car. I know the scuff mark on that grill. Yeah. 70 miles an hour going down right. the road. Yeah. You know your car. Like that's your right. first car, yeah. that's like For a baby. Sure. I pulled in yeah. there. Sure enough, it was my car. Right. And the guy said he had pulled it out of a junkyard. Somebody had already robbed it of the 327 and two-speed power glide. But it was sitting there. And it yeah. was, the guy asked, he knew. Like he see it, right. he could see it in your eyes. Right. There's blood yeah. in the water. And I was like, I can't pay that for that car. Right. You, you're sick, man. Right. <laughs> like, right. Why would you right. do that to right. me? Right. Why would you do this to me? But, you know, um, a few weeks later, I go back and it's gone. Yeah. Somebody had already bought it. So if you have that car... <laughs> Yeah, let's talk Hobby about it. Looking for that car. Think it's here in the Memphis area. How about you? Your let's, dad? Uh, Is that how you got into cars? Me? Your yeah, dad? yeah, my dad. Yeah, um, my dad had a. By the way, Sean's. You know, the two Sean's are the only ones that have valid fathers here. <laughs> <laughs> Sean Barrington's the only one that had a, a a dad that was a car guy. That's right yeah, for sure. Right. That's funny. Yeah. No, he had a. 
he had a 69 Super B. I mean, he was in the cars a long time before that. Right. But, you know, that was that was the car that I remember. It was a black yeah. on black 69 Super B with a 440 with, nice. with uh, yeah. two fours on it. And uh, it would run 10-2 at 123 back then. It was like, how do you remember all that? I, I just I just remember. It just he, no, he, no, he yeah. practiced it in the mirror. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. That's how he picked up chicks. He's like, it'll run 10-2. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, no, I don't know what any of That's know probably more that than I, I heard it a billion times. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Heard it every Look, Heard it. Bad boy. 10 twos. I'm telling <laughs> it'll it'll hop a skull can on yeah. bumper. <laughs> but, but, yeah. but but you know one thing though that that uh, that Javier had brought up earlier was that, it, that um, you know I he sold the car like on his four right. or something you know and then there were no cars there for a long time but but we would go to you know NASCAR and watch watch right. races and and stuff like that so um, so I was always into cars but until until I became of age to buy the 55, right. then there weren't really any cars there, you know? Yeah. So, so, you know, dad wanted That's me fun. to, to have yeah. something that I could work on and build and learn how to, Turn a wrench, right? So that's so you that's your own car. Yeah. yeah so that's, that's awesome. how we ended up with the the fifty five. Yeah, yeah. You but got I mean, a good dad. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. That doesn't happen too often, man. I, the, the I, good dad thing. Well, no, the, no, no, no. It's only on our side from, of well, town. I was gonna say for, for me and Mike are sitting. You're right. <laughs> so fifty percent so of us in the room. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This is how is this how y'all picked who was coming to this thing? Who here has a dad? Who here's got emotional trauma? Everybody. Okay, let's do something else. We need both of those. <laughs> but, but, I mean, you know, we're talking about the first car thing. So, yeah. my first car was a 77 Toyota Corolla. Yeah, of course I, it I'm was. I'm not looking for that, man. Yeah, you I, are. No, I'm not. If no. you've seen it, you get it. No. No. <laughs> It was, it was no, we're not talking about a, we're not talking about a, a, a specimen. We're talking about the car, the, the one, okay, the one. Let, let me tell you about this car. It was such a piece of junk. My mother sold it in a yard sale. When I was done. <laughs> it was in the bin, yeah. in the junk bin. I mean, some lady gave her two hundred and thirty bucks for this car, right? And it right. was what a random number, too. I, I, I think, I did think they, she, that's where they start. I think it was two fifty. Did they come? They negotiated down. You lost your, your mic's mic. off. Yeah. yeah. Um, it was two fifty, and you they hit went the down. button over there. It's got to be on. Uh oh, what's happening? No. All right. Well, really he's done. All um, right. Well, hold <laughs> tight. Um, let him have this mic here. Rehook up that cord. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Hang out, and then with just us. slide just... on over. Sean, our IT guy is gonna not Sean not Young. Lee. Sean Young. Not Sean, not Sean Young. Wow, why did you say that in an Oriental slang? There. Why do you that? think that's Oriental? <laughs> what? Part Sean Young. Oh, is that how you said that? Well, looking at the. Uh, no, you got to plug the cord. Everybody's saying our plug the cord in right here. up there. Yep, Everybody's right saying there, the echo is go. really bad on uh, Facebook, so I don't well, know if we I don't should, know what we should do here. What I don't do know if do? I should just cancel you guys on there and then they've been canceling me my whole life. Just see if that if that's better. I don't know. It honestly sounds like it's coming from the sound over here. Yeah, yeah, because I'm now getting an echo here in my. Yeah, I can I can hear right, the echo in mine that? too. Can oh, you? he's in now. I'm in. There you go. Yeah. Bring, bring your chair closer, Sean. <laughs> yeah, if you can tighten that thing up over there, I don't know how to. Um, there you go. How do you go about that? No, hold on, bud. I had it. Let's see. All right. While he's working that out, a short yeah. word from our sponsor. <laughs> we don't have any. Steel uh, Rose Metal. Oh, hey, hey, <laughs> yeah, all right. What's yeah. the address over there? We'll do a quick spot for that. Yeah, yeah it's 509 North Hollywood. There you go. Steel Rose Metal Gold for all your metal deeds. That. What was the address again? 509. Line. Uh, now you got to do the 30s voice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You got to do that. It's old timey radio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you got to do like the step right up. Oh, you know, oh that, yeah. That, that, that one. Steel Rose Medical for all your metal needs. <laughs> there you go. I like the Don Pardo one first. Yeah. Which the, one is that? The, the first The old time. I don't know the names. I just know the voices. The, the this is my voice problem. for SNL was Don Pardo. It, yeah. It, that kind of, it was what it sounded like. Yeah. That was good. Is. I Don can do that. Pardo. Give me an intro and I'll do it. I can't remember. That's no fun. An this intro what? Wait, what? What would he say? This week's musical guest is... Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> this week's musical guest is Cher. <laughs> Cher. That's funny. Quit touching your microphone, by the way. Yes. Yeah, so, my uh, mom's been telling me that. Me <laughs> it's, making it's not going to stop me doing it. Yeah. I feel yeah. like you I grow I feel like, hair in your palm. <laughs> Quit touching your mic. <laughs> She's right. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, uh, Sean Young is back on the mic. Let's. Uh, okay. Thank you for. Yeah. Doing so your 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 import. I didn't know uh, you were a tuner. Guy. I was a tuner guy. Yeah. A, well, I, actually, I had, it had uh, had a points distributor in it, so I don't know wow, if that. That's yeah. Crazy. Seventy seven. Um, was that the drift car that the, no. the initial D the Corolla? No, that's no, a. Uh, it's a seventy seven Toyota Corolla. There's a Corolla car that's a. A drift, uh, like an iconic drift car. Don't get me to line. Man. I don't mm -hmm. know. No, yeah, there seriously. is a Corolla. It's a, that, yeah. Initial D was like a anime type thing from Japan. It was a Corolla. I don't know the year. I want to say it was like a eighty. Yeah, 70, I, yeah I think it, right. it wasn't my car. I yeah. can tell you. That. Was it yeah. white? Yeah. No, it was red. It, but it was but sold it, at a garage sale. I think I heard about this. But car. it was a sport <laughs> coupe. Sport coupe. There it was a go. sport <laughs> coupe. Yeah. Wait a minute, though. Didn't you have? Didn't you have a, a Toyota or something at your at your shop? No. Yes. The, oh, yeah, no, the, wait, you were doing uh, metal on. No. Are you lying? There was a no. no there was a yes. Z. There was a two eighty. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. Toyota. Oh, it was an oh, import. I knew that. Oh, you didn't say import. import. Okay, you since we're just talking okay, about it, import. I had an import phase. All right, Fast and the Furious had just come out. <laughs> Vin Diesel. Uh, Vin Diesel. Had, he shaved his he head. Was <laughs> he was smooth off the set of Pitch Black. Okay, so I was. So <laughs> it was less to do about the cars. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, fast, <laughs> so Fast and the Furious, I got to say that 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 uh, is one of those movies that that tells the difference between generations. It I did. cannot stand Fast and the Furious. Like I was, I was an old dude, I guess, compared yeah. to you guys. You wait, know, how, like, wait, how like, old were you when it came out? Not how old you are. We don't want to know. Uh, he was like, he was like right. 35, 36. 50. <laughs> <laughs> Right, how, I probably was. I was follow up question: I'm How old, old are you now, I'm Satan? <laughs> Fifty. Yeah, I'm, I'm the old one in this group. I think. How old are you, no, Sean? I'm fifty. Fifty-two. Oh, I'm fifty-one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So you guys, and are then y'all are the youngsters. You just, you just look like you're twenty-two. Yeah, <laughs> that must be from coming from that side of town. I was wondering. I was wondering <laughs> how <laughs> someone yeah. so young would amass so much wealth. <laughs> 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 that's what happens with the good, good side of the track. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Soft yeah. lip. What happens? Hey, uh, that's what happens when you have a father. Right. <laughs> <laughs> a nice supporting figure. We had to fight in the streets. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm choking I'm, up over that I'm, one, man. That was just hard. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that Mike and I probably fought each other when we were younger <laughs> for scraps. It was right. a Disney movie. <laughs> <laughs> Like Dumbo over a, over a bologna <laughs> sandwich. <laughs> it was the opposite of that one where the dogs kiss over the spaghetti. Yeah. Lady and the Tramp. It was just two tramps. Yeah. Two tramps. <laughs> tramps. Coming to a theater near you. That's hilarious. Never. <laughs> oh. uh, no, yeah, I'll I'll cop to that. I had an import deal and I was yeah. right on the F, right on the crest of that <laughs> when it was going out. I couldn't afford the really cool car, the RX seven. Yeah. I mean, I'll tip a hat where it's due. The uh, the turbocharged Supra TT. Yeah. I wound up getting an IS three hundred four door because it was like a compromise. I'd already had my son at that point, so I was like, "This is the same motor they put in the Supra, but it's an Alexis it's a four door." <laughs> <laughs> I need this. I got it was solar yellow. Oh, yeah, there you right? go. See, that's, yeah. that's, that's, sporty. The that's the automatically last yellow. makes it faster. <clears throat> thought, like stickers. Oh yeah, like oh, yeah. stickers add twenty horsepower. Right? It was a Lexus bunny. That's okay, how, that's how Dodge I know did what it, circles man. you ran in. Dodge did, <laughs> well, Dodge did like stickers. You know, when you were buying a three eighteen, you know, in the big heavy car, they'd put stickers on it and say that this is this is high performance, man. Right. You're stepping into that world. But yeah, Dodge yeah. absolutely did that. Creative marketing. Well, we could talk mm -hmm. about uh, naming for that matter in the marketing teams going all the way back naming of cars you yeah mean? i yeah. mean like it's been said and done before but like in the hispanic culture which is borrowed I, how come there are no ca canadian named cars oh, sure there are acadia yeah. Or, uh, that's a yeah, Acadian. That's, that's, that's just because the, we're the not chevy from two there. the chevy two is called no, 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 acadian. All right, for example el camino the street for those that don't speak <laughs> Easy Spanish. Oh, I never. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I did not I know, know that. I never knew that. that. <laughs> I never knew that. 
I've been walking around El Camino <laughs> my whole life. Ranchero. I'm, I'm, I, technically, I Mike I and I are from El Camino. So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's going to be the next T-shirt. El Camino. I'm from the uh, El Camino. I'm going to have to start giving, stop giving Mike, uh, Plumber Mike, so much hassle about his El Camino. That's a really cool car name. Yeah. yeah and, and then you got uh, Chevy was real bad about it. That. I don't know if it's just a, like a California thing and they were close to Tijuana, but the the, the Nova and it's been Nova. made fun of before, oh, yeah. which when you break that down in Spanish, if you it doesn't go. Right. No va right. does not go. Right. They changed they That's changed it in, in the South Nova. South America. Don't quote me on this, but I think, they I think in the South, South American America. market they had to change it because the sales were so bad. Because yeah. it says because well <laughs> nobody's gonna go to the dealership and be like I want one of them cars that doesn't go. So it, it, when, when, they, when they got down to Mexico, it I guess in Mexico into, or so they wouldn't say it like that. That was a really southern. Why is there a southern landowner in South America asking for a car that doesn't go? Well, I mean, I know. want one of them cars that doesn't go. <laughs> well, and mean, also Ford, all the women owned a bunch of land in South America. Henry Ford it, did. Yeah. Well, that was yeah. a different thing. Yeah. yeah he, was, I think technically Argentina. was there for the cheap. Uh, cheap labor. Well, a lot of people. No, no, he wasn't Argentina. there for their cheap labor. He bought a bunch of land. I, I There's think a rubber the, tire factory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rubber, rubber tire it was, factory. It was for yeah. the uh, the rubber trees. Chile. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And Isn't he uh, Chile or started Argentina, like a commune yeah. down there. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Big big business tycoons have been down in Argentina. Yeah, well, all the way down. I mean, we're gonna go back to the World War II, but like, there's a lot of cool stuff going on down there, and we ha we live in such a bubble. I think History he was, he was, you know, had a place down there that I know that he was uh, hiding Nazis. I didn't want to say it. <laughs> oh, man, I, was really, I was really trying hard. Here comes the Hitler theory. <laughs> Every <laughs> time we get on public radio, <laughs> it goes directly, and it's from you. It's always it the is. side of the table. Right. Always Anything you. you want to cop to yeah. there, guy. <laughs> Jeez, that's funny. That's, Jeez. We're gonna we're gonna pull back off that. I, I, if I'm the Maverick in this aircraft, I'm gonna just yeah, you're, I'm gonna you're hit the brakes. He's gonna fly right by me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> As I say, I think it's all of our responsibilities to uh, slow down everybody else. Yeah, I know. So, thro we're throttling back. Yeah, yeah I'm it. the worst person to do that. <laughs> to do that too, or to do here. that? No, 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 you're wide open. I'm, yeah. I'm actually proud of you. You haven't you haven't let go of a F-bomb yet. Mm, I mean, it's still a little Amazing. early. I'm warming up. <laughs> kind of new to this whole thing. <laughs> I'm warming up. It's still a little early. They're coming. Yeah. You, you can bet. All right. So what's next topic? Oh, uh, well, what, I mean, we talked about our first cars. Um, I didn't talk about my first car. Um, mm -hmm. You know, because... It was, I, a, it was a bicycle. It was a motorcycle. <laughs> it was a bicycle. Uh, I mean, I guess technically, but... Uh, I don't know. What are we? Uh, what are we looking like on time right now? Uh, we've got about. Yeah. We're, we got about, about ten, 10 minutes. more minutes, so yeah. so Let's we probably quick. need to take ten minutes to kind of wrap it up um, and thank everybody. Um, yeah. Thank you guys for for logging in and and checking us out. Um, hopefully, we'll do this more often. Yeah. Um, our, our I think our plan, if this goes well, is to do every other week. Yeah, yeah. Something. To see with, if we can do this and, with less and make echoes, it a thing. less yeah. echoes. Yeah, there's yeah. yeah. some technical difficulties. Right well, the right. the echo thing really is just on Facebook because we have all the pictures going. So I think what we'll do is just do one. Yeah. Next time, or just do right to where video you can see all together. All of we us. won't do it on yeah. Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe yeah. so. So maybe so. But not a big deal. Yeah. So our, our GoPro turned off. It got too hot. Oh, yeah, 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 that's okay. I have that same problem. That's usually yes. what happens. When I get too hot, I Getting just turn too off. Hot. I just turn off. Yeah. They get smoking. Yeah, yeah. That's the biggest problem with GoPro, man. They get hot. They get hot. They, hot. they eat batteries. Yeah, yeah like it's going on a style. Yeah. And the hotter they get, the, the quicker yeah. the batteries go. Yeah, yeah. Yes. GoPro. If you're listening, that's a solution you want to look into. Yeah. Well, I mean, <laughs> I, I really think that they should probably send us some royalties for the random plugs. I mean, the eight people that are watching me might <laughs> invest in a GoPro right Am now. My eleven. You're 11. I mean, that's you know that is. Oh my god! Is I just thought 20. about that. It's <gasps> are these? I, I have four. I have four people watching me because technically we're all watching our, each other. I have five, but I you got to subtract the people in this room. The two people at home. Because <laughs> <laughs> we have 16 people in the room, and somehow only eight people are watching. I, I don't, don't do maths, okay? Yeah, I told you where I'm from. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so I had two fathers. Joining. I had two fathers. 
Yeah, there, have been, <laughs> there have been a few joining here and there. I've seen <laughs> yeah, some yeah. come on. So, so people at home, like yeah. as far as the, the podcast that we're doing, FYI, we're going to actually add people kind of moving forward. So we'll have, you know, a guests. lot of neat guests coming in. It's not going to be just, you know, us four idiots in here making, you know, you know, horrible jokes at each other. It'll it'll actually be kind of entertaining. So yeah, yeah, we three like idiots to, and the college educated guy. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. we'll I'm, do some we'll do some history things here and there. I mean, obviously, all of us are very interested in the history of of Memphis uh, rotting and things like that. So, um, and we're we're connected to some of those folks. So we'll definitely um definitely yeah. do some some things where we have those guys come in and kind of talk about uh, some of the stuff that they've done and and uh, you know some of the history of Memphis and, and rotting. Cause yeah. God, yeah. I mean, it, it, obviously There's a lot. We, we, we know all, a few guys. Yeah. Right. There's a, I mean, yeah. that, that reunion was awesome. You yeah. reconnect with everybody. Yeah. yeah. I, this the, was the, a great icebreaker. I think, um, we'll find our voice. Yeah. Yeah. And for our, sure. And our fathers. <laughs> 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 and me and Javier will end this broadcast out hugging. <laughs> That's right. It's it's just going to be him hugging me. <laughs> <laughs> so they might be on the next one. They might be uh, alcoholics back in the uh, right. back oh, in the gutter. Might, yeah, we might be on vacation. Why we got to be back in the gutter? The, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry. Hey, my hey, bad. hey, bro, my I never bad. left the gutter, bro. Uh, his white privilege is showing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Go Why you got to be white? Why can't it just be privileged? I just be privileged, yeah. yeah. There's there's yeah. brown privilege too, man. <laughs> <laughs> yes, man. You think like no. there's a whole social status thing that happens in every culture. Yeah. I'm still at the bottom on that one, too. Yeah, I'm with you. <laughs> I'm with you. That's funny. So yeah, that's 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 what we're uh that's what we're planning on doing. We're trying to get a, a podcast rolling um to promote car culture, um anything car related, um bring in people that we know. Um, and just kind of, you know, shoot the BS and, uh, and, uh, see if we can, uh, you know, promote car culture, car world in the Memphis area. Um, because that's, that's where we're at and, uh, we want to promote more of it here, bring people on and, uh, and keep it going and, uh, help each other out. So yeah. that's our goal. Um, that's what we're going to do with this. And, uh, let us know. Um, feel free to throw some feedback on there. Where the name. We, where yeah. We, yeah. Where, we, where we lack, where we need to, because none of us have done this before. We're just winging it. I mean, that's kind of our yeah, thing. This anyway. is, we we kind of wing We yeah, kind of wing it with everything we do. But that's people, fine. So. I, you know what? But we talked about this in the pre-pre-meeting and probably at the post-meeting. You guys are invited if you want to come. Right, that's right. right. Yeah, probably Brookhaven. Anyway, the... Uh, we do our best stuff when we're just hanging out. And that's really, and I told uh, Mike that when we yeah. he's like, I don't know how we're going to do this. We need to make a list. And you were concerned. And I wrote the list before you got there and yeah. didn't give it to you, I think on purpose. Yeah. But the, <laughs> the whole thing about that was uh, it's not genuine unless yeah. you're having, like, I, I want what I would hope for when I tune in and I do listen to a couple podcasts, I always yeah. trail off when I feel it's too structured. Right. Yeah. When what I like about a podcast is feeling like I'm in the room with the guys. Right. Like I'm part of that group. Now, are we cool enough to have other people sit in on us <laughs> we on, don't know. on an audio? I don't know yet. <laughs> I mean, I, right. yeah. it's really early. It's it's day one. It's episode one. Um, and I think we'll, we'll do some remotes, and then we'll invite right. some cool people in, and there's going to be stories. And uh, well, that, that's my hope for it. That's why yeah. I'm hot chocolate. Absolutely. Yes. <clears throat> I love hot chocolate. Yeah. And as we get as we get a little bit closer to to our Memphis Legends event, we'll be talking about that. Yeah. Exactly. A bit more. Well, exactly. We've got so, things that yeah. we're trying to get done with that and um, get it moving. So, Well, that sounds good. We appreciate you guys. Remember, yeah. leave us some feedback. Um, let us know what, what you think about it, what we could do better, um, what we did well. Um, everybody likes accolades and, and positive reinforcement. But we'll take negative criticism too. So just yeah. throw it out there. Other than the echo thing, we know, we know we echo. Yeah, the echo so thing fun. sucks. Um, On Facebook. So We're not super techie guys, so... Right. We'll figure it out. We'll change some things up. Yeah. But uh, yeah, if you know, uh, if you have ideas on uh, a name of what we should call this podcast, yeah, there are some names out Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. We'll do that. I think uh, the Legends Facebook page. We're going to probably have this put up there, and we've also got a Memphis Legends YouTube page and a channel rather that uh, is going to have this as well. So you can comment on all that if you uh, you know if. If you've got something against Mike and you're not really feeling it, that's you know, okay. Just just let me know. That's fine. A he's lot of people a, do. He's a hated man. I let am. me tell you. I am. Yeah. I am. Well, <laughs> I'll have it on Auto Enthusiast Network too. I'll have it on all those pages and stuff. Yeah. So we'll share it around. Yeah, yeah, me too. Um, put me down 
for one of those something. something. I'll pages share some up. stuff. I need uh, a page. I've the, got an Insta page, but the El Camino nobody would channel. Have, it's I thought a four eight. No, just us. It's four. I don't. I guess everyone else quit. I have four people now, and it's just it's funny. Us. It's just it's us. just you. That's it's it. Okay. I like it. Okay. We're here. But if you have a page, right. I like it. I promise. <laughs> well, cool. All right. Well, so right. Sean Young, Javier Augustine, yeah, and Mike Abbott, mm -hmm. and I am Sean Brereton. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, just us BS, and so uh, hopefully you guys like it, and we'll uh, we'll do it again uh, if everybody is. Uh, is on board. So we're I'm doing board. it. Yeah, anyway. I'm doing it. Anyway. Whether you're we're on, on board, board or not. Yeah, that's right. We're <laughs> going to do it. it. We're going to do it anyway. I'm not out until I get a, a solid eight. Yeah. When I get a real <laughs> eight. That's right. <laughs> so, so everybody friend Javier on online. Right. And uh, so you don't he, even he, have to friend me. Just, just tune friends. in. Just tune friends. in. Mention me in the comments. All right. We're I good. will send you a card. So, yeah. <laughs> Handwritten. Yeah. Handwritten in Spanish. All right, folks. Until next time. Uh, uh, this is Sean signing off, and uh, hope you guys like it. See you guys later. Bye, Bye. 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 Bye.